जय हिंद द एम ऑफ दिस प्रेजेंटेशन इज टू मोटिवेट यूथ टू ज्वाइन एन सी सी एन सी सी वॉज फाउंडेड इन नाइनटीन फोर्टी एट बिफोर वी गो एनी फर्दर लेट्स हैव अ लुक एट प्रोमिनेंट एल्यूमिनाई ऑफ एन सी सी द ग्रेट फ्रीडम फाइटर नेताजी सुभाष चंद्र बोस वॉज अ कैरेट ऑफ यू सी टी विच इज अ फोर बीयर ऑफ एन सी सी करेंट प्राइम मिनिस्टर ऑफ इंडिया श्री नरेंद्र मोदी इज ऑल्सो एन एन सी सी एल्यूमिनाई श्री मोरारजी देसाई श्री राजनाथ सिंह श्री श्रीपद नाइक श्रीमती सुषमा स्वराज श्री ज्योतिर्राज माधव सिंधिया एंड श्री हामिद अंसारी हैव ऑल्सो बीन एन सी सी कैडेट्स अ नंबर ऑफ स्पोर्ट्स पर्सनस आर ऑल्सो एन सी सी एल्यूमिनाई सच एज कर्नल राज्यवर्धन सिंह राठौर हेमा दास अंजलि भागवत तेजस्विनी सावंत एक्सेट्रा एन सी सी हैज ऑल्सो गिवन टू द नेशन सम ग्रेट आर्मी जर्नल्स एडमिरल्स एंड एयर मार्शल्स इंट्रोडक्शन टू एन सी सी एन सी सी इज द लार्जेस्ट यूनिफॉर्म्ड यूथ ऑर्गेनाइजेशन ऑफ द वर्ल्ड विद मोर देन थर्टीन लैक एन सी सी कैडेट्स इट्स हेड क्वार्टर इज इन न्यू डेली इट्स अ वॉलेंटरी ऑर्गेनाइजेशन विच एनरोल्स कैडेट्स फ्रॉम हाई स्कूल्स कॉलेजेस एंड यूनिवर्सिटीज ऑल ओवर इंडिया एन सी सी इज अ ट्राई सर्विस ऑर्गेनाइजेशन कॉम्प्राइजिंग द आर्मी नेवी एंड एयरफोर्स इंगेज इन ग्रूमिंग द यूथ ऑफ द कंट्री इन टू डिसिप्लिन एंड पेट्रियोटिक सिटीजन्स एन सी सी कैडेट्स आर गिवन बेसिक मिलट्री ट्रेनिंग इन स्मॉल आर्म्स ड्रिल एंड अदर मिलट्री सब्जेक्ट्स द ऑफिसर्स एंड कैडेट्स हैव नो लाइबिलिटी फॉर एक्टिव मिलट्री सर्विस द कैडेट्स आर गिवन इंसेंटिव इन वेरियस फील्ड्स बेस्ड ऑन दियर अचीवमेंट इन एन सी सी नाउ लेट्स टॉक अबाउट हाउ एन सी सी केम इन टू बींग ऑन सिक्सटीन अप्रैल नाइनटीन फोर्टी एट द नेशनल कैडेट कोर केम इन टू बींग अंडर द नेशनल कैडेट कोर एक्ट नाइनटीन फोर्टी एट टॉकिंग अबाउट द एवोल्यूशन ऑफ एन सी सी इन The girls division came into being in order to give military exposure to girls. The NCC was given an inter-service image in 1950 when the air wing was added, followed by the naval wing in 1952. Aims of NCC. There are three aims of NCC. The first is to develop character, comradeship, discipline, leadership. secular outlook spirit of adventure and ideals of selfless service among the youth of the country second aim is to create a human resource of organized trained and motivated youth to provide leadership in all walks of life and be always available for the service of the nation the third aim is to provide a suitable environment to motivate the youth to take up a career in the armed forces cardinal principles of ncc obey with smile be punctual work hard without fuss make no excuses and tell no lies the motto of ncc is unity and discipline ekta aur anushasan ncc pledge we the cadets of the national cadet corps do solemnly pledge that we shall always uphold the unity of india we resolve to be disciplined and responsible citizen of our nation we shall undertake positive community service in the spirit of selflessness and concern for our fellow beings there are a total of 17 ncc directorates the names are given in the slide ncc training activities can be broadly divided into five categories institutional training camp and attachment training social service and community development activities adventure and sports activities and youth exchange program During NCC camps the cadets get a practical training in various military subjects 
like drill, weapon training, map reading, field craft and battle craft, obstacle training, etc. Social service activities are an important part of NCC training. NCC cadets take part in various social service activities like flood relief, blood donation, Swachh Bharat Abhiyan, awareness rallies, etc. Under Youth Exchange Program, NCC cadets visit these foreign countries Bangladesh, Bhutan, Kazakhstan, Kyrgyzstan, Maldives, Nepal, Russia, Singapore, Sri Lanka, Turkmenistan and Vietnam. To promote the spirit of adventure among the cadets, NCC conducts various adventure activities every year such as parasailing, paragliding, sea diving, mountaineering, trekking, rock climbing, etc. Apart from training and preparing the youth for future challenges, in NCC, cadets are given various benefits in terms of job opportunities, scholarships and financial assistance at the time of any injury while doing NCC activities. These incentives are announced from time to time both by the central and state governments. These incentives are in the field of employment as well as academics and personal including medals, trophies, cash awards etc. The best incentive being the vacancy reserved for C certificate holder cadets for the commission as officer in the armed forces. Now let's talk about the various incentives given to NCC cadets. We have broadly divided them in four parts. Career at a glance, financial benefits, honors and awards, and incentives provided by state governments. Part 1. Career at a glance. Commission in Defense Forces. Every year, 64 NCC cadets clear UPSC and SSB interview. Thereafter, they are trained in IMA Dehradun and then are commissioned in Indian Army. Under NCC Special Entry Scheme, every year 100 NCC cadets are commissioned in Army. They don't have to appear in UPSC exam, they directly appear in SSB interview. After clearing that, they get trained at OTA Chennai. On successful completion of training, they get short service commission in Indian Army. Other incentives given to NCC cadets for employment in armed forces are shown in the slide. In CRPF, NCC C certificate holders will get an additional 5% of the total number. The bonus marks of B and A certificate holders will be 3% and 2% respectively. In National Cadet Corps, there are posts like civilian gliding instructors, girl cadet instructors and whole time lady officers reserved for NCC cadets. Besides this, preference is given to NCC cadets in various state government jobs. Talking about private sector, Many industries and corporates give preference to NCC C certificate holders. In sports, cash award is given to teams and individuals for excellence. Part 2 Financial Benefits Expenditure of NCC training is borne by government. No payment for uniform, camps, parade, adventure activities and sports activities. Refreshment during parade and wholesome meals during camps are given free of cost. Various kinds of financial assistance are also given to the cadets. Cadet Welfare Society A society named NCC Cadets Welfare Society was established and registered in February 1985 under the Society's Registration Act 1860. The purpose of forming the society was to give financial assistance to the cadets next of kin or nominee in case of a demise during NCC activity. 
Its purpose was also to give financial relief to cadets on sustaining injury or disability during NCC activity. Also to grant scholarships to academically brilliant cadets. The Cadet Welfare Society also gives financial assistance to conduct sports and adventure activities which cannot be funded by public funds. The details of financial assistance given by Cadet Welfare Society in case of death or disability is given in the slide. Now let's talk about scholarships and best cadet award given to deserving NCC cadets every year. Scholarships. Every year, 1,000 scholarships of rupees 6,000 are given on the basis of academic performance. Out of total 1,000 vacancies, minimum 250 scholarships are given to cadets coming from rural or disturbed areas. Best Cadet Award. Based on the performance of a cadet in NCC, there are best and second best cadet award given at group headquarter level. The best cadet is given an award of rupees 3,500 and second best cadet is given an award of 2,500 rupees. Honours and Awards Every year, Padaks and Commendation Cards are awarded to eligible NCC personals and cadets. These include Raksha Mantri Padak, Raksha Mantri's Commendation Card with Badge, Raksha Raji Mantri's Commendation Card with Badge, Raksha Sachev's Commendation Card with Badge, DG NCC Commendation Card with Badge, and Best Cadet Award during RDC. Incentives by State Government Different state governments give different incentives to NCC cadets. Let's talk about Andhra Pradesh. The Andhra Pradesh government gives weightage of 5% marks for 2 foresters, 3 beat officers and 4 assistant beat officers. 1% seats are reserved in each courses of engineering college, medical courses, MBA, MCA, MA, MCOM and other degree courses. The Bihar government gives 5% weightage to NCC cadets in various state government jobs. 1% seat is reserved in all medical, engineering and polytechnic colleges for NCC cadets having B and C certificates with either A or B grading. The JNK state government gives preference for recruitment to non-gazetted post services in police, home guard, forest and excise department to an NCC C certificate holder. Talking about admission in educational institutions, 2% seats are reserved in Kashmir University for the candidates possessing outstanding proficiency in NCC. In Karnataka, there is reservation of seats for NCC cadets in various professional courses. In Kerala and Lakshadweep, A, B and C certificate holders are given weightage of 2%, 3% and 5% respectively for selection in uniformed forces in the departments of police, jail, excise, forest, fire and rescue services. The Kerala government also gives reservation to NCC cadets in admission to various professional degree courses. Likewise, the Madhya Pradesh government also gives weightage to NCC cadets for taking admission in various educational institutions. In the similar manner, the other state governments also give preference to NCC cadets in job opportunities and also in admission to educational institutions. You can pause the video and read the details of each slide as required. The youth of independent India is extremely fortunate to have such an organization existing in the country which devotes vast amount of financial and physical resources towards their personality development and thus is indeed a nursery for grooming future leaders in various walks of life. 
विद दिस दिस प्रेजेंटेशन एंड जय हिंद